we have to keep it in order. But I tell you, I thank God for those precious memories. Sometimes those wonderful memories of people who've gone on and did just, I, I thank God that he's taken the sting out of death. Where death is a sting, where there's a victory, or grave, where's their victory. He takes that sting out of it and replaces it with just peace and comfort. Thank him so much. I talked about the song last week, and it's been on my mind, and I don't know why I, did, I want to do it. And I told that to Sue, and she goes, well, if, and I know why, because God's told you to do it, and so this is what we're going to do. And I don't know if we, we grasp, when we say I'm a child of the king, we don't have a king here in this country, and so I don't know if we can grasp that what that really is. And I admonished you last Sunday to understand that if you are a Christian, you are a child of the king. You are a prince or a princess is exactly what you are, and you are a saint and you are a child of the king and it's time we started living our lives as if we were children of the king because that's exactly what we are a child of the king my father is rich my father is rich in houses and lands he holdeth the diamonds of silver and gold his coffers are full he has riches untold I'm a child of the king a child of the king with Jesus my savior I'm a child of the king Son, the Savior of men, once wandered on earth as the poorest of them, but now he is pleading our pardon on high that we may be his when he comes by and by. I'm a child. my Savior, I'm a child of the King. I once was an outcast stranger on earth, a sinner by choice and an alien by birth, but I've been adopted, my name's written down. To a throne, a robe, and a crown. I'm a child of the King, a child of the King, with Jesus my Savior. I'm a child of. 